Well, I think it's fun because the show definitely um, pokes fun at, at the whole kind of hipster trend. But yeah, I mean, that, that awkwardness between two people who, de- who like recognize each other and are no- definitely noticing each other but just can't approach each other, I feel, I feel like that's so universal. Um, and it's kind of part of the silly games we play mm-hmm. with, I mean, I, you know, th- these particular, uh, characters aren't even, like, at the courtship phase, yeah. but, you know, it's all part of that whole dating game, or, like, yeah. even, like, leading up to the dating game, like, just getting to know each other. There are so many, like, just misunderstandings and things left unsaid or, you know, not even broached, so, yeah, I love that the show kind of tackles that as well yeah so I, you should all definitely watch season one um it's it's a really kind of fun you know pocket of time that you could spend watching all the episodes but i think where we left it is um guy and girl actually do meet at a party so at the beginning of season two what can we look forward to well season two actually takes up the very next morning so it's kind of like, what happened that night? <laughs> There's some ping pong that happens. Ooh, ping pong. It's fun. Um, there is a, a tattoo situation that might be happening. Um, what else is going on? There is, oh, well, there's another guy oh, that enters right. the picture. That's kind um, of a big deal. Yeah. Thank you so much for donating to the campaign. It really means a lot to us. Please help us continue to spread the word, and we are so excited to share season two with you. And remember, you can get all of your hipsterhood needs met by going to hipsterhoodseries.com.